to a husband and wife review. I'm the husband. I'm the wife. And tonight we are dining on Stouffer's Sautés for Two, Braised Beef, and porto, uh, Portobello Tortellino. Tortellini. Oh. Tortelloni. Oh, yeah, Tortelloni. Yes. It's a braised prime rib steak and portobello mushroom tortelloni with spinach, diced tomatoes, and portobello mushrooms in a marsala wine sauce. And what's a really good kicker for these is it cooks in 13 minutes. So where we worked all day and didn't want to come home and cook, we had this. And boy, is it yummy. Oh, yeah. You know, so as usual, we always start off with a salad, basic bag salad. Dice up some uh, avocados, cucumbers, tomatoes, throw them in there. We'll gonna throw some ranch on top. That's how we start ours off. Then we get into the basic rubbery. Yeah, and it's not the best salad. Again, like he said, you know, bag salad and uh, some cucumbers and tomatoes and a couple slices of avocado. Normally, and I've said this before, but we're still on the same bag. Um, I do add a whole lot more to my salads that they can actually be eaten by themselves as a meal because I put everything in there. So, you know, we'll get into that one of these days. You'll see one of my salads. But uh, today was really about being able to get off from work and to be able to prepare a fairly decent gourmet meal in 13 minutes. We had frozen broccoli, so we threw that in a pot to steam with a little water while the main course was stewing and I had already cut up my veggies, you know, so we've got salad for a couple days because we eat salad with our meals. Mm -hmm. so, Excuse me. So there's nothing wrong with tossing a salad in there. The whole point is to at least have a salad before you dine. Because it's a filler. So if mm -hmm. you're trying to lose weight like I am, you know, having your salad is very, very important in addition to your vegetables with the main course of your meat. It definitely rounds out the fiber in your day if you eat unhealthy. So, steamed broccoli, a little salt and pepper, that's all. Very good. Now to dive into the entree itself. You know what, I'm gonna wait. Let's see where you at. Let's see, typical on a regular off-camera eating. Oh. He would've been done. I'd be down. You see, my plate is already bigger than hers as it is. And the kicker with this meal is I do not like mushrooms, so yeah, I don't like mushrooms. And they're in there, but they're chopped up. I hope so. Mm -hmm. Nice. Mm. Mm. Not bad. The toro, the toro, toro loni. Pretty good. Bite into it. Splashes out with the spinach. Mm -hmm. Cream spinach somewhat. Well, it's not cream. That. It's great in the <clears throat> in the marsala wine sauce. Mm. So it's almost cottage cheese, ricotta cheese. That texture, not that cheese, but that and the spinach. When you bite into this, that's what blows up in your mouth. Mm. I don't know if we can if you can see that mm. from there, but it's definitely <clears throat> it, it it's yummy. Bits of beef in there. Mm. Nice and tender. Oh yeah. You know, it's always good to, I can say this. I learned a lot of eating from my wife. I'm the, I was, I'm, when I met her, I was a cheeseburger, two cheeseburgers for breakfast, two cheeseburgers with some chips for lunch. Two cheeseburgers and maybe some fries, maybe a pizza, 
maybe a chicken parmesan. That's what I was eating all the time. Any of that, I was eating that all the time. And then uh, once we got together, then I started to have meat with, you know, the sides and veggies. And then as we got older, she got more conscious of our health. And uh, I have to say, I've tried different foods. But where I'm going with that is, uh, when you expand your taste buds like that, you can sit down to a meal like this that only takes 13 minutes and be full. Because I'm guaranteed I'll be full with this. You know, I won't have to snack or anything after that. This is a filling, a, a, a big enough meal cooked in such a short amount of time that, you know, I can get all that I need healthy, plus be satisfied when I'm done with this meal. Mm -hmm. Because some wonderful people took all the hard work out of this because having some braised beef that takes a long time to cook and <clears throat> I'm sure whoever made this pasta it was made from scratch and you know where I'm going with that so I know I don't want to be in the kitchen that long so if 13 minutes is all that has to be done for dinner 13 minutes it is and it makes it easy for the two of us because he cooks one day I cook the other day and this makes it real easy as you saw two pots one for the vegetables one for the main course and a bowl for salad everything straight in the dishwasher wash up two uh, I should say one pot one pan and you're done for the night and I'm sorry you know the glass of wine because definitely gotta have something to drink while you're eating but I mean clean up after this is really really simple and as you just saw when we talk about this I don't know which review how he dribbles and it runs in the family you've now seen him dribble and with that We'd like to thank you for dining with us once again. I'd like to thank Stouffer's for sautés for two. Go on out there and get you a nice little gourmet meal that you can have for under 15 minutes. Mm -hmm. And they're very inexpensive too, so mm -hmm. it's definitely easier on your wallet than to go to a five-star restaurant to have somebody prepare this. So again, kudos to Stouffer's and kudos to my baby. Mm -hmm. Yes.